some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Schenectady, New York, with Daniel from New York State Audits as he and his girlfriend are having a bit of an issue at a local pharmacy. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hey, how's it going? I'm the one that calls. Excuse me, officer. Watch your language. Hi, how are you? The woman that just got shushed by Daniel and asked to be quiet by the cops is definitely no stranger to being arrested herself. Daniel, if you want to wait outside, I'll come talk to you. I'm going to talk to them first. I'm going to wait right here. It's fine. Uh, it's not fine. They don't want you in the store. Yeah, they don't have a right to tell me not to come here, though. something you can argue later. But... No, nah, not really. And there's no argument. So, sure, if you have a valid reason, you can ban them from the store if you choose to leave. No, no yeah, absolutely fine, but um, I'm just... There's four cops here. Yeah, no, don't worry about it. So, Daniel, if they have a valid reason and they ask you... Yeah, what's the valid reason? What's the valid reason, though? Be arrested for trespass. What's the valid reason? He was here picking up medication for his son. It's HIPAA okay. law. She can go to jail for that. Okay. I've already got off the phone with, uh, with her bosses, the corporation. And she's being dealt with so from the company. There's, there's... What she's doing is illegal. And we have it yeah, all on tape. We have it all and, on tape. She has and to actually, I'm the one who actually. Order of protection. I'm the one who called you, so That's I'm not right. really sure why you're talking with her. There, there is an order of protection on his behalf. Um, he's a protected party, but this is my place of business. This is where I And she's not supposed to interact Bro, with him. Can you stop? No, not at all. I don't know these people at all whatsoever. We're just living in assignments and they were uh, my neighbor. Her dog attacked my dog. And then she had her boyfriend attack my boyfriend and my dog. Ma'am, can you please not interrupt her and give her well, some Well, if you guys did your job correctly, I wouldn't have to. We're attempting to. No, you're not, because uh, you're talking to her first and we called you. What's that? My personal Hello. information I will give to you yeah. alone. Just okay. want to look at me for a second? Go back to the office to get me from them. Sure. I just need to catch you because okay. I can go find another time, right? Okay. Can I get you to identify yourself, please? They have no choice. They have to by law. Can you identify yourself, sir? Can you please identify yourself? Well, you know the policy that you have? Fact, I'm going to the police department. Can you? you? Can you do that? Can you to the front, please? So, to the front. please identify yourself. Yeah, I'm not a good reader. Yeah, you mind? Out. Verbalize it for me? No? So you're going to just disregard your policy? What about your mission statement? Doesn't it say something about professionalism? Right? Yeah, right there. That, is that your name? It's a lot of right there's going around, huh? So, Daniel, tell me one thing. How do you get a job and hold it when you and your girlfriend have such loud mouths on you? Yeah, yeah. Nobody said uh, that to you. You brought it upon uh, yourself. You just make yourself look ridiculous, bro. Ma'am, is there a reason why you're antagonizing her? She should tell the way, truth. If there's any way you can wait she outside and be helpful. Truth. Can I get you to identify yourself, please, sir? Who? You. Who? Can I get you to identify my yourself, name's please? Aaron Lang. Badge my number, name. please. What's your name? Okay. You, you already said my name. That. You all know it anyways. I don't know your name. You just said my name, but <laughs> okay. A little longer than a few minutes later in here conduct my business and you know seek services and she's supposed to not harass me i don't think you're seeking services now no i was actually yeah no, you yeah okay. yeah you you don't you can't determine that so yeah how are you gonna say i wasn't seeking services when i was outside waiting for you now the way i understand this convoluted story is that the boyfriend of the clerk had a dog who ended up getting in a fight with Daniel's dog resulted in the clerk end up being having a order of protection put on her by Daniel and his girlfriend. Just about sounds like an old episode of Jerry Springer. All right, you sure you're all set? Yeah. All right, Daniel, watch yourself. Door's gonna open. Don't want you to open it. Do you have any questions for me? Um, she's obviously just concerned because you've been around for so long, but I mean, uh, no, that's not true. Well, that's what she said. Uh, well, yeah, that's what she said. I guess that's debatable. Okay. And stuff, you know. So, I, I've been outside. Is there anything about this incident on file? Is there anything you want to tell me? 
Yeah. I would like uh, your incident uh, incident number. I don't have that offhand. You'd have to go to oh, the car. Of, of course. Can you identify yourself now? Dwayne Beeson. Dwayne Beeson? I already have you on video identifying me earlier. Actually, you never said your name. You said my name earlier. I you said your name. Stay here or are you guys no, we're following you. We were waiting for you guys to respond. Yeah. That's the okay. only reason we're still here. Okay. Yep. You guys I, don't I, want to do your job. I called you at 3.30, and uh, i just it's been waiting outside. Seven. So, you know, because I could have been at home relaxing. Oh, I'm sure you must be tired. After a long day of frauding and acting like a complete ass, you got to go home and relax. Because that's all you're good for, that's all you'll ever be good for, is going out and acting like a complete ass and frauding all day. So, oh, hold on a second. Before you guys go, I uh, want to, uh... Can you give me my number? Wait, fo wait, focus. It's coming. Yeah, don't be rude. I would like I'm to... Not being rude. No, you're being, no, you're being very rude. All right, have a good night. Hold on, write it down for me, please. I, I don't have the number, man. I don't have the number. You're upsetting the dog. Can you please write it down for me, sir? <laughs> Excuse me. I would like her arrested. Yeah, I would like her arrested. I would like her arrested. I would like her arrested. She violated the court order. He just told you that's not happening tonight. Why not? Because it's me, right? Because it's me? Is it because it's me? Is it because it's me? Because I have a court order. A order of protection. And she I got to show it to you? It's in the system. Look it up. You know my name. He said my name. Well, the cops sure as hell can't help you if you don't give your damn name. So you know what that means? That means the cops are going to dismiss you. How does that feel, my man?